What is up everyone? I'm Elsewhere Green. And in today's video, I'll be going against I think it was the S badge broken wheel on Moonlit. Uh broken wheel on this map is usually pretty good. There's really not much windows to work with and pallets here are pretty short, so it's really easy for broken wheel to maneuver around. Right here, uh, Priestess Strike gets the win, but it's a little bit too late, so got her first spikes first. So, right here, she needs to be careful because she does vault slow and Broken Wheel is really fast. If she gets mind game one time, then yep, the second spike will come out. Uh, 20 seconds into the game, she's already two, spi two spikes on her, so she needs to dodge trap. She does have portals though, but we have no owl on this team, and that was a pretty nice Oreo. I didn't even know that was possible. So, instant down with Peepers. Uh, pretty bad right now. Um, Broken wheel, if you get someone down really early in the game, it's really hard for the survivors to come back, especially on a big map like Moonlit. I tried to go for a stun save, but the hunter know that I was coming, so it drops her down immediately. But this allows me to, you know, again, get in position to buy more time, and he does have peepers because I did see him drop a peeper right now. She did die in the open, though, so it's quite unfortunate, but I did do my stun a little bit early. So even if he isn't by the wall, I am able to get that push, but no stun, though. But this should help allow uh, Priestess to use her portals and maybe kite for a little bit longer for my team to decode because that that downtime is really quick. So hopefully what I did could help benefit our team. Uh, first presence though, uh, Broken Wheel user does bring insolence. So if she does get two spikes on, she's pretty much GG. Um, and there is two spikes, so she could eat uh, the hunters might use the skill. But I am also in position because she did die by my cypher, so I'm here, you know, die do as best as I can because Hunter didn't bring excitement, didn't bring peeper, so it's pretty easy for Ford to harass a broken wheel. You know, the only way a broken wheel can really, you know, bully a Ford is if they go in the wheel form. But he didn't do that. There was a size coming after me, he realized that I'm a really annoying brat. But uh, I got mind game here. That was a pretty, pretty bad play on my part. I should have vaulted that pallet. Uh, I should have walked around it. And I peeper, so I vaulted it really slow. Slower than usual. But, uh, since the hunter did decide to chair me, I decode slow either way. You know, it doesn't, it doesn't really benefit the hunter as much as chair and priestess. Uh, I think Perfumer Green Titus is getting ready to say, and Perfumer literally counters the spikes. Especially when the cooldown is about the same. Each time you get a spike, each time you could use perfume. It's about like about probably like two seconds off, so uh, Hunter is max spread perfume, just be careful, but it's pretty as long as you can make it to the chair before he comes out, it should be a free save, even though he's max presence. Go for the double hit, but this allows me to get into the window and potentially kite the hunter. I have two windows here to work with. He goes in wheel form and I'm able to use these windows to my advantage. But since I do evolve really fast, it's gonna be really difficult for the hunters to hit me. I see the hunter coming around. Uh, he's going a little bit too far. Now here, I guess broken wheel just mind game. There's really not, nothing you can do. If you can mind game well, then you know, just hide for a bit. Max presence, nothing I can do. Outplayed by by IDV. Net ease, outplayed. Uh, two cyphers remaining. Second time on chair. We should have a decent amount of cyphers. Just one cypher remains to go. One new cypher. So I need to make the save and maybe body block for a bit and have tie turner maybe. That cyber will be enough. So like from like you know early down to a tie, you know, a tie game, potentially a win. It's pretty good in our end. <clears throat> so again, uh, as long as you make it to the chair before it comes out, you know, it should be a free save. So Priestess didn't, you know, wasn't able to do that. They put a trap there, but you know the trap, the trap was kind of, I don't know, I didn't she didn't get stuck on the trap, so that was good for me. So Priestess Josh just had body block for me until he comes into wheel form, but when he comes to the wheel form, I have two windows to work with. So it's really the hunter's choice to either continue walking or go into wheel form. Per Peeper is down, slow me down for a bit. Uh, I have confined space, so these windows are blocked off. So you go in wheel form anytime, down, down me instantly. So right here, I try to go side to side, you know, make that body block work, and it does work. Going side to side works. Once I remain to go, 70%, I think the hunter is a little bit nervous about that cypher progress, so he does decide to go for the uh, cypher instead. So this allows me to live, and that's really good for the team, because I'm the only one dead on chair. Okay, 
Ice will keep it close to being prime, but he has max presence though. One hit, Prison is able to jump pop the surfer. That's good for us. Prison is at the other gate. Prison is running towards the other gate. As long as I don't get fouled because I am dead out of chair, we should be good to go. Or a tie. Nah, I lose. There's no way we lose this game. Yo, there's too many people up on the field. And both gates are being worked on right now. Uh, there's a portal there, so Perfumer is safe to go across the map. So he is forced to go to uh, the gate right here. And Priestess again not been on chair. And if he does decide to slug Priestess, she's able to steal really fast. In like 20 seconds, 10 seconds, maybe less. So he just definitely gonna be forced to cheer her. If he doesn't decide to cheer her, uh, she's gonna open that gate. But we all everyone's across the map, so it's pretty much GG's from here. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. Uh hope I see you guys next time. Take care. Yeah. <sighs>
Hey! <laughs> 